We're so thirsty, we're drinking out of our water backpacks. <laughs> <laughs> Jackie's, Jackie's choking, apparently. Let me laugh. Oh, God. <laughs> While Jackie's dying, the bad part about drinking out of these is when you're so thirsty, it's so hard to get so you're much. Like, uh, you can't it's get so it hard to get water out of them. Today we are headed to Snoqualmie Falls. Yes, we are. I think it's a short hike. I don't think Nothing it's too long. crazy. Yeah, so we'll see. I think there's like a visitor's gift shop center thing. Maybe we can see if they have any suggestions mm -hmm. while we're here. Yeah, our friend that Jackie met. Yes. Uh, travel nursing is up here in Washington. So she's going to meet us there. So yeah. that's kind of cool. It'll be fun. She followed me to Washington because I said... Um, like oh yeah I applied to Washington I guess it's a quick license and she's like oh I heard that too so we're gonna meet you there <laughs> so. all right let's go check it out Yay! well we have arrived <laughs> we parked in three different parking we're now in our third parking spot because Jackie Ooh. just can't decide what spot to be in well first I parked at the very front but then I decided then I saw a sign there's a pedestrian footbridge and I wanted to have a little better access to get to that and then I pulled into this spot over here <laughs> and I wanted, uh, then I decided I wanted to back up into the spot because we packed So much. we could have a picnic. Exactly. And then that way we can be in this grassy area behind us for our picnic instead of in the road. Are we good with this spot? I feel good. Are you sure? Yeah. Now we just have to wait for Trinity to get here. Where is the footbridge? Because I was across down there. Well, why didn't we park down there? Do you want me to move? <laughs> why not? <laughs> We have nothing but time. Okay. Get out of here. <laughs> um, but to now you. we're just waiting on Trinity to get here. I was so paranoid we were going to be the late ones. So I made us 20 minutes early. So what do we do with our free time? Do you park? <laughs> Till we find the right one. This one doesn't feel right. All right. Now we wait. I think we're finally settled. Are you sure? Maybe we should go around. Get right out of here. Let's talk about some parking. Let's talk about it. While we're waiting, we figured we would let you know yes. there is bus and RV parking. Jackie loves love the pointing. The pointing. Yep. Back behind there. So if you're planning on visiting Snowformy Falls with your RV, you can do it. You can. I think good old Fiona would even fit up here. Mm hmm. I mean, How would you feel about this turn, though, to get out? Eh, it's doable. Okay. Doable. Might be a little bit tight with a big RV That's like ours, but yeah, yeah, not too bad. I think it's doable. But if so. you're you find yourself passing through, it's an option. It's yep. An option yep. To have. Oh, oh yeah, thank you. Oh my coffee. We got out here. We let the kids run up this hill over there. Um, we'll see just to see, get some energy off while they're sitting here. And um, they said there's Camden reports. Hello. Tell us, tell us how many steps there are. There's two steps. And what's up there, Amelia? There's a garden <laughs> and, and there's. Parking. And parking. All right. Do you guys want to run up there one more time? Yeah. Okay, quick. Go. See ya. Shwing. Where are they? There they are. And now it's quiet again. And now we drink our coffee. Cheers. Liquid gold.
Oh, hello there. Hello there. <laughs> Fancy uh, seeing you here. Yeah. We're done at Snoqualmie Falls. Yes, it's it really pretty. And the sun cool. finally came out, so that was really nice to see. And now we're going to have some beer <laughs> we're at a brewery. and lunch. Yep, because that's what we do. Because we're in the Pacific Northwest, and yep. that's what you do here. Yep, you got to go to a brewery. Got to go. So, yeah. And there's a cute little town with, like, apparently this is a railroad town or something. There's, like, tons of railroad stuff. Mm -hmm. So, I think we might walk across and meander a little around through this town. Mm -hmm. So one fun fact about Snoqualmie Falls. Though, I'm ready. I'm ready. They use it for electricity. Yes. Like hydropower. They I didn't do. realize that before. Did you know? That? I had no idea. They no. use the water for hydropower. Yes. So that's pretty cool. Yeah, it's neat. <laughs> and then we were showing the kids how all the lights that are on here are because of the waterfall. Yep. I don't Definitely, know that that's actually true. <laughs> right. You don't have to go on. There's like a little half mile hike you can that we went on. <laughs> it goes all the way down. Yeah. Definitely recommend it because you can get pretty. right down by the river. Yeah. I mean. You can get a good view from, I mean... The upper up, viewpoint is good, but the yeah, lower ones... Better. Which is maybe a couple hundred yards from the parking lot, so... Yeah. You just want to make a quick stop just to see it, but definitely recommend the hike. Yes. It's a little half mile, easy <laughs> yeah. hike. It is definitely downhill, do it. though. So, it's, it's a little... It's and down to the there. river, but it's pretty. It's yeah. worth it. So, Alright, let's go I'm eat. Yummy. Do it again. Mmm, delicious. Is it? Tell Here's me good. all about it. Got the Wednesday special. I'm so you only get that if it's Wednesday, though. That's true. <laughs> Hence the name. I got poutine, but it's not here. I'm sure it'll be delicious. I'm sure. Just wait. Stay tuned. I'll give a full report once I've eaten it. Good. My food came, and it is worth the wait. Really good? So good. Yes. Look at that cheese poutine. curd. Mm. Look at it. And, and what did great. you get? Poutine. Poutine. With carnitas. So it has cheese curds and gravy and fries. I got this. It has oh, Amelia got it. the grilled cheese. It All right. has okay, cheddar quit it. moving it. There we go. It has right. cheddar. It has cheddar. Cheddar cheese. I got this. Kim got the corn dogs. The food is definitely delicious. Definitely Enjoy recommend Snoqualmie Brewery if you're in the area. Mm -hmm. It's delicious. And the mural in the background. It's a cool place. I'm happy here. Good. Yeah. yeah. That's what we care about. And if you're happy, we're happy. And I am. <laughs> and we're going to explore this little town and go see the train tracks. Yep. There's some old trains we passed on the way here. And a Camden huge wants tree. To see. Did you see the tree? It's like over um, under like a pavilion. It's gigantic on like a train oh, car. Oh, yeah. Like the, yeah. It's gigantic. Yep. We'll have to I check it out. in downtown Snoqualmie yeah and they have this uh, train museum here Huge. it's pretty cool and yeah there's a building back here as Jackie points like she hates me doing that has a huge like tree trunk that they have cut down for some reason so we're, so we're guessing how old it is yep we're taking bets how old it is I'm guessing about 1200 years old I it said is 1600 huge. Yeah, but yeah this uh, train museum is pretty cool yeah a bunch it, of old trains it appears to be free Right. At least, At least I hope we it hope is. it is. Cause cause, all that <laughs> right. Um, but there's like a little gift shop and a bookshop and stuff like that. But there's just like, oh my gosh, when we were driving in, there's so many vintage cars. We're gonna right. go down there. Lots next. of old trains. Um, but very cool to see this. Camden got real pumped about the steam engine. So. I mean, this tree is huge. Let's see. 
See how old it is. Guess what? Okay, yeah, we're it at doesn't the log. Say. It doesn't say. It's what the so heck? Big. This thing is huge. But it doesn't give us the answer we so right. desperately seek. Apparently, they use this little wagon or trailer to take these big 10 to 15 foot diameter logs to the sawmill to be cut up. Yes. But we're very disappointed to find out it doesn't years? say how old it is. No, it's, it's a scanner. A scanner. That says learn more right there. Oh, so maybe Wait, I can I QR code it? I think I was probably right, though. I don't think so. 1,200 years. I was obviously right. I might what be do you think it is? <laughs> what do you think? How old is this It's hard to tell because the middle of it's... But look, here's But me. it's, yeah. I'm five foot two. Now granted, it's up a couple feet, right? How big it is. Huge. I wonder one. how people could even pull it. Well, it goes on the well, train goes on that and the steam right engine there. pulls it, remember? And then they pull it to the mill to be chopped up for lumber. Chop, chop. Tell me when we're on. We're on right we're now. We're on. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we are done in Snoqualmie. We are. It's a cute town. It's very cool. Yep. Yeah. The cute town, cute little shops. Yes. Waterfall. Train museum was pretty cool. Yeah. The, really the whole package. Yeah. The great brewery. It's beautiful. You have a view of the mountains while you're here. Yes. But nice. after a couple little hikes, and it's a little warm here in Washington. It's, uh, it's warm. Like, it's it feels like it's 80-ish. Yeah, let's see. But, uh, yeah, I think we feel like we deserve some milkshakes. We so. do deserve milkshakes. And we kind of had late lunch with the brewery food. So I think we're going to have milkshakes for dinner. Yep. Head back to Gig Harbor and yes. have a milkshake at the local yes. place. We've eaten, had some shop. there once before and they were delicious. So. Yes. That's going to be our pseudo dinner for tonight. <laughs> milkshakes. Yes. We've earned it. We, we got our exercise it. for dinner. We really have. <laughs> for real, we're having milkshakes for dinner. Yep. Don't have that very often, huh? Right. Take advantage of it. All right. Let's head home. We're so thirsty, we're drinking out of our water backpack. <laughs> <laughs> Jackie's, Jackie's choking, apparently. Oh, God. <laughs> While Jackie's dying, the bad part about drinking out of these is when you're so thirsty, it's so hard to get so you're much. Like, uh, you can't it's get so it hard to get water out of them fast enough. Uh, also, when you're climbing uphill on a mountain like we did the other day, you're like out of breath because you're climbing uphill Ooh. and so you're already out of There's breath and then you're trying to head. suck the air or the water out of these things. <laughs> They're wonderful. I mean, I love having the like all of these for all of us. They have like two liters. It's a great investment for the hikes that we do, but right. but sometimes it, they're challenging right. to suck out of. But if you have any ideas of how to dry them out when you're done, put it in the comments below because that is the worst part trying to get these things to dry out so you can yeah. put them away. Well, because, I, I mean, <clears throat> obviously we live in an RV, right? So it makes the drying out process a little challenging because we try to do it in the shower. Our shower's not very... Traffic. Y'all are supposed to act like the camera is here. What's the what's the rule? Bring the food in your mouth, not your mouth, the food. Yeah, exactly. Oh, there's Amelia. Amelia's. There's Amelia's hash brown B roll. Yeah. <laughs> is it awkward having somebody record you while you're eating? A little bit. Good. 